Hi my lovely Scorpios, welcome back to my channel. It's time for your reading for the next week. So let's look together what messages and energies do we have for you for the sun, moon and rising sign in Scorpio. And if you are the cross watcher, as you already know, it can be vice versa, but doesn't have to be. You will know who is who here in this reading, okay? What we have for you Scorpios, I hope some amazing stuff for the next week. Let's see, let's see. We are ready, right? Overall energy for your reading we have. This is good, positive energy. Eight of Pentacles, focusing on your work, focusing on your career, on your money and success is coming your way. Also, for some of you, someone will be focusing on you. Maybe you are dealing with some earth sign here, but doesn't have to be. This is very, very positive uh, card here to have. And uh, as you already know, this reading can be connected to your love situation, to your professional life, or maybe some another situation or relationship in your life. Doesn't have to be for all of you, just romantic reading. Okay. Okay, but this is very positive energy. The Emperor, look at this Taurus Aries. Uh, maybe you're dealing with Taurus Aries, uh, but you will uh, you will take the control back. Uh, you know, you will be the boss here in this situation. This is beautiful Knight of Swords, uh, hmm, the Ten of Cups. Oh la la, uh, action, action. Uh, look at this. Someone loves you. Someone wants uh, to light this, light up this fire with Ace of Wands here. Fiery energy. Uh, what is happening? Huh? that also we had here um, we have uh, here the death your major arcana the chariot uh, look at this all, all this major arcana cancer energy movement uh, but successful movement also we have here these two wolf um, wolves look at this this is a balance this is uh, black and white look at this this is very very good um, someone want to Someone wants uh, to make the effort uh, in this relationship. Someone is willing to, to fight for you. Someone is willing to give themselves to you, to open themselves up to you. Uh, Knight of Wands, fiery energy, because they want you. You can expect a lot of movement, especially if you, if you have had the ending with this person uh, recently with the death there if right now you're not together you know you can expect a lot of positive movement from this person uh, fiery energy and the decision too of uh, pentacles earth energy again this earth energy and look at this infinity symbol always returning to each other look at this what should i do what should i do uh hmm undecisive energy hmm uh, the chariot you will be a little bit in this energy you know uh, let me clarify for you the chariot first. Why we have the chariot? Oh, uh-huh. Because you don't trust them. Five of swords. You don't trust them. They hurt you so bad in the past, you know. Uh, that is why. Huh? The Wheel of Fortune. Look at this positive turn of events. Yes, movement, movement, movement. Yes, uh, you are not together, I, I would say. Or for some of you, this happened already for some time ago, you know. And, and you you are still in this process, uh, trusting them one more time to, op to give them another try, you know. But positive turn of events with this Wheel of Fortune, Sagittarius energy. Uh, they are coming, they are coming, uh, Mr. Devil, Capricorn. Look at all these major arcana. This person is obsessed with you, uh, but also jealous. Or maybe you are jealous a little bit, Scorpio, huh? One person or both of you are jealous here. Uh, we have here possessiveness, jealousy. Uh, last also, they want you so much. Uh, they have uh, such a passionate... Um, they find you, uh, they, they see you as very, very passionate person. Uh, of course, you are Scorpio, right? But uh, they are thinking about you all the time, just to let you know. This person is... Uh, or maybe it's mutual. You both are obsessed with each other, with this uh, mystery. Mr. Devil, but also, you know, this uh, has to be changed, this fighting, this nasty words, this um, a little bit of manipulative energy I'm feeling here, also controlling energy, one person is very, very controlling here, this has to be changed because this is toxic in this relationship, uh, what we have here, the uh, four of, uh-huh, four of pentacles, possessiveness, jealousy, holding on, 
controlling uh, energy, the Empress. Are you kidding me? We have the Empress and the Emperor here. Knight of Wands, I'm clarifying for you, Knight of Wands, the Empress, growth, new beginning, but uh, also look at this uh, match made in heaven. The Empress and the Emperor we have here in this reading. Match made in heaven. You are such a, wow, uh, good, good match here. For some of you, we have here the Twin Flame Union. The Seven of Cups, confusion, confusion, confusion. For some of you, you have child with this person or for others of you. They have child or you have child from the previous relationship. Also, we have here this situation. Knight of Cups, yes, this person was a player a little bit uh, with this Knight of Wands energy, you know. They were immature, they didn't want to commit here and that is why they were treating you like an option here. And uh, you don't want this because that is why this uh, fight happened, you know. Uh, what we have here, the... Ten of Swords, ooh, foo, 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 foo. painful ending, very, very painful ending we have here. Uh, hmm. And the Ace of Swords, new beginning. After after this breakup, new, you can expect new beginning, but this is also the, the you have the second card of the victory success to, together with this chariot. Ace of Swords is victory. Ace of Swords, I'm now, uh, I know where this is going. I have uh, got my answer. Uh, I receive my answer. I will get the clarity about this whole situation, you know. Uh, this is what we have here. Open conversation will take place here. This is very, very positive. Air energy. Maybe you're dealing with air sign. Uh, ten, of so um, ten of swords. We had there ten of swords. Uh, painful ending. Um, two of yes, because this was a player for some of you. You were, you know, um, maybe they were um, flirting with another people. You found out, you know. Uh, also this for some of you we have here two of pentacles yes for some of you you found out that they were juggling you and another person you know uh, this is just for some of you you know if this is the case here the world but look at this the world uh, ending and new beginning we have here again this ace of swords second time ace of swords uh, new beginning they want uh, they want a new beginning uh, four of cups but they also they are uh, afraid of your rejection they are afraid that when they will appear they are still a little bit gathering the courage here because look at this the world uh, this knight here in this uh, this course uh, he is uh, not still he is not uh, here you know because uh, he's just absorbing what is happening inside of, the, of this castle. This is uh, your place, maybe your house, your flat, your working place, with your social media. They are checking out, you know, on you. They are they are busy with spying on you, but uh, still they are figuring out the approach. Um, this is what I'm feeling here, you know. They want, they want to speak up with you, but uh, they want to clear the air with you. But they are afraid of your rejection. You know, this is what I'm feeling. That is why they are in this indecisive energy. What should I do? What should I say? What should I say? Because I'm afraid that my Scorpio will um, reject me. You know, this is what I'm feeling here. And the judgment, your Scorpio energy. Uh, they will fight for you. with This eight of pentacles here, the judgment. They want second round. They want, they want you back. They want you back. What do you want? What do you want, Scorpio? Do you want them back? Hmm? Um, I would say that you do. Hmm? What we have from this deck? Let us see. I remember every detail of that day. Hmm, is the first message here. What else? I wish things could be different. Hmm. I wish things could be different. I hope that you can forgive me one day. Yes, for some of you, you found out that they were juggling you and someone else here. For some of you. What else? I can't stop thinking about you. What I was just saying before. Obsession, possession, jealousy. Hmm. And uh, they are spying on you all the time, just to let you know. You came closer than anyone. Uh-huh. Hmm. What else? I replay uh, our conversation over and over. Yes, this five of swords, you know, um, you both uh, hurt I um, each other in the previous fight, you know, in the last fight that you two guys had uh, before. Um, this is what I'm feeling, you know. Uh, I feel you leaving me behind. Yes, they are afraid. They are afraid of your reaction, of your rejection. Um, mm -hmm. And what we have from this deck? I love this uh, this deck. Balance. 
Hmm, is the advice here. Love is not always about agreeing just for the sake of it. I, a great relationship is one that uh, both uh, supports and challenges. Hmm, this is very, very nice. One more, okay? Ah, this one. This one wants to came out. Uh, life is uh, a series of uh, constantly shifting cycles. Mm -hmm. When we resist change, we resist uh, the natural flow of life and create uh, unnecessary stress. Go with the flow. You will be surprised where it leads. Wow, beautiful. This is beautiful uh, advice here. Uh, sexual, what we have here? Sexual union, hmm. uh, honor the place uh, in one another where you are one eternal soul for the for there you will find uh, true bliss. Wow, this is beautiful. Uh, hmm. Yes, okay, this is what I have for you. I hope this will help. I'm wishing you a beautiful and amazing week. See you soon, and of course, don't forget uh, Scorps. Good vibes, only kisses.